You know that feeling in your gut, your stomach, where you know something is off with the woman you're seeing? Uh, she could be drifting away, becoming distant. Uh, the patterns that she used to exhibit with you, they start to kind of change. She starts to um, make excuses. Well, you have to understand something. Women are going to lose interest in you, whether it's two weeks down the line, two months, 10 years, however long. And that's because women require constant attention, constant validation. And as a man on this purpose, on this grind in his life, it's extremely difficult to cater to overgrown children. Okay? Guys, if a woman starts to distance herself, don't panic. Don't get upset. Don't be afraid. Don't try to uh, do a lot to bring her back in because I guarantee you she's already cheating. She's already uh, got her guy or multiple guys set up. Number one. Now, this was quite obvious. If her text message starts to get less and less or um, five to six hours down the line, she's replying to you or she gives you one or two word answers. Listen, she's not into you. She's losing interest and she's most likely has multiple guys in the picture. Remember, women love to conversate with guys who they're really into. They love to send long paragraphs and ask you how her, your day is going. Let's say you're used to getting text messages, good morning, handsome, in the mornings, and you're no longer getting those. Listen, just uh, acknowledge it, uh, stomach it, and just move on because she's already moved on. Mirror what she's doing. So the less time you know she's getting back to you and it takes her five, six hours, you take five, six hours until it all fizzled out. Listen, women like to uh, slowly punish you and then cut you off. It's a sad ordeal, but this is the female. If you start to experience less and less communication, whether it's over phone, text messages, whatever, just end it right away. Just distance yourself and walk away. Number two, women are creatures of habit. So let's say you guys are both used to getting together Friday or Saturday throughout the week, and all of a sudden she uh, starts to want to reschedule or do something else. The reason why she's doing this is because she has another guy in the picture. She wants to get rid of your day, the time you two have set aside, and give it to another guy. Also, if she comes over and you're used to her staying overnight and uh, spending night at your place, what will happen is she'll start to say, oh, I, I got something to do in the morning. I'll have to leave early. She'll start to cut your date short. And that's because she wants to be with and see another guy. She wants to get her back blown out by Pookie or Tyrone or whichever Chad, okay? Listen, you see these behaviors of her uh, not wanting to be around you as much or she cutting your time down slowly, slowly but surely or she's want to reschedule. She don't want to be around you. She wants to be around another guy. I guarantee you. Number three. Now, this is key. If you start to see a woman uh, put her phone face down everywhere you go, maybe at the table or on the counter, you might be out to dinner and you can never see the top side of her phone, the screen. She's doing this because she doesn't want you to see the notifications or text messages she's getting from another guy. Okay. Or if she starts to go to different areas of the house with her phone or bring it to the bathroom, bring it to the kitchen, wherever, she doesn't want you to see who's texting her or who's contacting her whether it's on social media or a dating app, wherever. Also, if she has her phone on her and she sleeps with it under her pillow or she keeps it really close to her, that means she wants to get every notification from another guy or whichever guys. She's losing interest and she's uh, seeing other men. Remember, her phone is everything. If she always has it on her possession and she can't keep it, put it charged up and set it somewhere and enjoy you guys' time together or her phone is never face up, and it's always face down, you already know she's on her way out the door. Number four, if she starts to take garments, clothes, shirts, leggings, different uh, items from your place and bringing them back to her place, slowly but surely, or shoes, you know she's planning her great escape. She's slowly drifting away, okay? She's getting ready to leave you or she's cheating on you with another guy. She's losing interest, all right? Remember, women love to have uh, different belongings at a guy's house. So if she starts to take them away, you know she's out the door. Don't let a woman uh, catch you off guard with these things. I had a woman tell me before, oh, I just um, have to dry clean this shirt. And the reason why she says uh, she has to dry clean it and has to take it to the cleaners and not, oh, I just have to wash it is because I had a, a, 
a washer and dryer down in my place. So dry cleans means she's going to take them and go and you will never see those items or her again. Number five, if she talks about going away to school or going on the tropical vacations, uh, different areas, different countries, or she wants to go on a road trip, but she doesn't include you in it. Listen, she's drifting away. She wants to start a new life somewhere else, or she just wants to try something new, turn a new leaf and have different experiences. But the common denominator is you won't be in those experiences with her. Number six, let's say you give her a call and after two rings, it goes right to voicemail. What she did was look at your call and hang up or she responds to your call uh, with a text message. It says, hey, what's up? That's disrespectful. That means she's saying, I don't want to talk to you. And most likely she's around another guy. Either she's getting piped down, drilled from behind. She's uh, doing something with someone else or the guy she's dealing with or multiple guys, whoever. They don't want you to know each other. So she's hiding you from her. If she will ever, listen, if a woman ever texts you after you try to call her, it's a wrap, man. Just walk away. She's distanced herself. She's cheating on you. I guarantee you. Number seven, if she's losing interest in sex, this is a big one. She's not really into pleasing you. Let's say uh, she's used to giving you hair for 30 minutes or even longer. She'll cut it down to three to five minutes. Or let's say she comes over your place or you guys get together and she tells you, oh, I just want to cuddle now. If you ever hear she just wants to cuddle and she doesn't want to sleep with you, what she's telling you is, she wants to get the emotional part from you. She wants you to be her emotional tampon. She wants to get the cuddles from you, but she wants to get piped down by another guy, okay? Or if she has poor hygiene and she's not shaving, you start to see a big bush, you're like, where was this at when we first were dating or seeing each other? Or let's say uh, she's just used to her wearing lingerie and nice little outfits, nice little skimpy things before you guys uh, have sex. If she's not doing that and she's just, you know, just let's get it over with. She's not really into you. She's into someone else. Number eight. Guys, let me ask you a question. Whatever job you work at or in the past, who is always the ones at the time clock counting down the seconds, looking at the clock, ready to clock out and go home for work? Women work. Women don't like working longer than they should. They want to do their 40 hours or however long their shift is, and they're out of there. They're one of the first ones out. Men are usually the ones who stay longer, et cetera, et cetera. Now, if you see a woman, your girlfriend, whatever, trying to pick up extra shifts, especially on a Friday or a Saturday, and she uh, wants to stay longer, or she starts to uh, say, you know, hey, I got to do extra work, she just doesn't want to be around you. Always remember, when it comes to women getting off work, she doesn't want to she doesn't want to work longer than she actually has to. If you see her start to uh, want to do more things at work or just pick up shifts and, and work longer hours, I promise you it's easy to see somebody else outside of work or she's seeing another guy at work and she wants to spend time with him. Either way, she's cheating, she's losing interest and you need to start to distance yourself and pack your bags and leave. Number nine. If she starts to buy new clothes or cut her hair short or, uh, you know, dye her hair, all these exotic, crazy colors. Listen, what this means is she's trying to go see another guy. She's trying to attract someone else. She wants uh, a new her. OK, she just doesn't want you to be in the picture with that new self that she's doing. If she starts to buy a lot of uh, short, skimpy clothes, little skirts, and she starts to kind of want to go out on girls nights out more and says, hey, you know, I want to hang out with the girls or do this. Listen, she's trying to attract other guys. She's looking for her next encounter, her next piece of meat. OK, if she starts to buy different bras and different things that you never see those uh things that she's wearing or little thongs, or whatever. She's wearing them for another guy. Okay. I guarantee you, listen, it's fine for women to buy clothes. You, we know they're materialistic, but she, if she starts to buy these, uh, three, four, six inch heels and you guys never go out and she never has those on or that, that top that pushes her breast up. I guarantee you she's wearing them for another guy for a girl's night out or for whoever, but it's not for you. Is not to please your eyes. Number 10, always watch what a woman does, not what she says, guys, okay? 
let's say you guys are hanging out together at her place or your place. And she says, oh, all of a sudden, hey, I got to go out and get something. I'll be right uh, back. I'll be right back. Or if it's late at night, she has to go out and run out to her car to go get something. And she brings her phone with her. What that means is she's going out to see someone else, especially if she doesn't say, hey, you want to come on with me? Let's go to the store real quick, me and you. Women like to be seen by the guy that they're with, the guy that they're into. So if she's going out, going out to run little errands and leaving you at the house like you're a little pet, or go to a grocery store, go to uh, check the mail or whatever, and she's taking a long time, hour, two hours, listen, she's losing interest, she's cheating on you, and she's either calling a new guy or texting a new guy or doing whatever, but I guarantee you she's trying to move you out of the picture. She doesn't want you around. She's leaving you and telling you, I'll be right back, like a little kid. Okay, guys, these are the 10 signs a woman my top 10, that she's cheating on you, she's sleeping around, she's losing interest. Listen, when a woman's losing interest, she's already has another guy in place. Remember, women do these things slowly but surely. They cut you slowly but surely. They can never just outright just get rid of you, boom. They can, but a lot of times these are the signs that are there. Just acknowledge them, um, mirror her uh, ways, and just suck it up and get ready to you make your moves and plan your escape because there's nothing you can do to try to change her feelings or change anything that she wants to do.